let's talk about sleep. Sleep is the foundation that everything else should build on. Without sleep, dieting, exercising and supplements will be useless. Professor Matthew Walker is a neuroscientist and sleep diplomat whose book Why We Sleep explains that you need seven to nine hours of sleep every single night. One out of every two adults in America are not getting the recommended eight hours of sleep and one out of three people are trying to survive on six hours of sleep or less. What's interesting is the number of people who can survive on six hours of sleep or less, rounded to a whole number and expressed as a percentage of the population, is zero. But what does this mean for our health? Once you get below seven hours, we can measure impairments in the brain. The shorter you sleep on average, the shorter your life. Short sleep predicts all-cause mortality. After 20 hours of being awake, you are as physically and cognitively impaired as you would be if you were legally drunk. A lack of sleep costs most nations about 2% of their GDP. If you're dieting but not getting sufficient sleep, 70% of the weight that you will lose will come from lean muscle, not fat. Our body becomes resistant at giving up fat when we're underslept. Men who sleep five to six hours a night will have a level of testosterone 10 years their senior. Changes in testosterone levels occur naturally during sleep, rising during sleep and decreasing during waking hours. Research has shown that the highest levels of testosterone happen during REM sleep, the deep, restorative sleep that occurs mostly late in the nightly sleep cycle. Sleep disorders, including Interrupted sleep and lack of sleep reduces the amount of REM sleep and will frequently lead to low testosterone levels. There's strong evidence of a relationship between low testosterone and sleep apnea. Men with sleep apnea are also more likely to suffer from complications in their sex lives, including low libido, erectile dysfunction and impotence. So what should you do if you have a hard time falling asleep? Regularity is most important. Go to bed and wake up at the same time every day. The last hour of the day, stay away from screens. Turn off most of the lights in your house at night, two or three hours before bed. Keep your room cool. Your brain needs to drop its temperature two to three degrees Fahrenheit in order to sleep. Studies show sleeping naked can help. Warm your hands and your feet to move blood away from your core out to the surface. With the warm bath, you get vasodilation and all of the blood rushes to the surface. When you get out, you have a massive dump of heat from the body and the core body temperature plummets. Sleep and diet. Don't go to bed too full and don't go to bed too hungry. Diets high in sugar and low in fiber tend not to be good for sleep. This results in less deep sleep and your sleep ends up being more fragmented. Supplements. Melatonin is useful when traveling between time zones. It fools your brain into thinking it's time to go to bed. Thank you for watching this short video. If you would like to know more about what affects testosterone, then check out my previous videos below. And don't forget to subscribe for more broad-minded content.